Perform hand washing and wear gloves. Place the infant on the weighing scale. Remove the flannel and place it on top of the examination table. Note for the weight quickly. Bring back the infant on top of the flannel, supporting the occipital area and buttocks to prevent head lock. Cover the body parts which are not included in the procedure to prevent hypothermia. Start the procedure in a cephalocodal technique. With the infant lying on a supine position, measure the head circumference by placing the tape measure behind the infant's head, running across the infant's most prominent head part, which is slightly above the brow line. Normal value is 34 to 35 centimeters. Measure the chest circumference. With the infant lying on a supine position, bring down the tape measure behind the infant's back and run the tape measure across the infant's chest should be along the nipple line. Normal value is 31 to 33 centimeters. Measure the abdominal circumference. With the infant lying in a supine position, bring down the tape measure behind the infant's waistline and run it across the abdominal area, slightly above the umbilical area. Normal value is 31 to 33 centimeters. Measure the length. Position the infant in a lateral position, left or right, and the length of your non-dominant arm should be supporting the length of the infant's body. Place the tape measure starting from the back of the head, following the contour of the infant's body. Run the tape measure along with the infant's spine. Press against the buttocks, press against the popliteal area, and press against the hillside. Normal value is 50 centimeters. Make the infant warm and comfortable. Do aftercare, remove gloves, and do hand washing. Document all the findings in the infant's chart, including all the actions taken in case there are abnormal findings. 